This is Zig Vermanic from Sumatra Development here to show you a pre-release of our exchange to exchange full state calendaring migration. So over here you can see an on-premises server with Zig, Jimmy, and this is Russ. Um, pretty blank right now except for something that's there for Jimmy. Let's bring up what uh, Zig's calendar looks like on uh, Office 365 and what Jimmy's calendar looks like. Well, we're now going to insert appointments for both of them. Actually, we're going to insert appointments for all these people and several others. And we'll watch that come in. We're not going to cut away here or compress this in any way, just so you can see what's happening. And we start seeing some meetings going in and, oh yeah, they're full state because Jimmy has invited Zig. Let's just put that away because you don't want to see the debugging information. Oh uh, yeah, there we go. Lots more information coming in. Yeah, so we've got recurrence patterns which are being um, kept. We tell you that stuff is being migrated. So these are um, daily meetings. Zig, of course, being at the end of the alphabet, comes in last. Oh yeah, migrated recurring appointments, got all those. Let's just keep that watching. And here, I'll just open up one of them to show you. Clearly, it's a recurring appointment. Oh, yeah, there's Zig inviting Jimmy. Jimmy's supposed to decline. He hasn't done that yet, but I'll show you that in a second. Ah, good, that's done. Oh, yeah, and there's all my recurring appointments. Uh, let's just take care of all the guest responses. So, Jimmy declined that meeting, and it's gone. Okay. All the ones that Jimmy has accepted or that other users have accepted amongst themselves, those are taken care of. Um, and we can see that just by opening up one of these and going to the tracking tab. Yep. Declined. All right now, one of the great things about our technology is once you're done with it, you can use it for testing and then let's say we want it we made a bad mistake not that this has ever happened in real life but maybe you just need to get rid of all that data click undo out it goes but notice that was in Jimmy's calendar at the beginning if you remember that um, and it stays there all right that's our full that's a quick preview of our full state exchange calendar migration. We showed it to you this time going from Office 365 to on-premises. Clearly it can go the other way as well. Thank you very much.